and I can't remember my password, it says, so it won't let me log in. And I can't use your wife's computer. Go live now. Please, and let's see if farm's off. There we go. Well, you're live. What is it? That's what Casey says he can hear us. Thanks for your uh, how-to yeah. video. That really helped a lot to getting everything figured out and set up. Hi! Can you hear us? Oh, good. <laughs> See, now you know, I don't have to just listen to your two dumbasses. I love you guys, but damn. Yeah, too, too bad it's not full video conferencing so everybody else could talk in. Oh, they will. Oh, okay, cool. That's the thing is... They can hear us, but we won't hear them. No, so, no, that's, that's what I'm saying. It's too bad we can't do uh -oh. that as well. <laughs> it's, it's real fun trying to listen to them talk and then watching them trying to catch up on the screen, but we'll do it. All right, let me take a look at the paperwork. You can talk and say hi. We are breaking Bowman. Okay. That's what they requested. All right. We just happen to have lots of that. We can get it. Do what I want you to do. Now that where I'm sitting, however, it is, they get to see me. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Where you're probably going to want to move. Yeah, I'll move in just a second. I'm trying to paste. Okay. Uh, told you I was going to. Fine. Do? What? Are you trying to do? Um, I think. I wonder which video they see. Well, we've got the one of the TV, or of the table, plus the one that's pointing back at me. Right, that's what they're going to see. Both of us. Oh, they see both? Yes. Oh, okay. Wonderful. Both. <laughs> oh, you got hers open. Crazy. 
The only thing I'm thinking we have a problem with is trying to figure out how to screenshot the random record to randomize stuff. With the second computer, we could just move the webcam to that. Click on tools. Where? I don't want to talk and have you guys all hear me. Go away. <laughs> hey, talk so we can hear you. Mm -hmm. No, that's what they're saying. Yeah, of course I want to hear you. Voice behind the face. Yeah. Tell me where the tools are so I can figure out how to screenshot doing a random on this. Come on. They're going to give you your solutions. Give me a second. Let me figure out where we're going to work with it. Okay. Give me a second. You're fine, it's them. And a 10 second delay. Computer punch, click on tools and click screen capture, then click on random that I want page and it will show you. Where is the tools option? Okay, click on tools. Yep. Yeah. Hey ass hats, where's the tools option? Top bar. Yeah. Well, the X split screen. Mm. Where's the X split screen? There should hot tools. There we go. 
Oh, wait, what did he say? Not the breaker screen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Screen capture. Tools. There is no screen capture. I have share your stream, my recordings, and general settings. So I'm talking to them. We know. We have solution. Ram dial is what we need. Okay, there you go. You got it? Oh. Let's see. Let's see if I can get this to where everyone can see it. And I have Is that close enough? No. Because the problem with this is we're going to have to click with our fingers. It didn't take it. Hold on, guys, I'm bringing it up. Casey's on his phone, not his computer. I'm just minimizing what you have here. I'm not closing anything. Okay, so when you put up the, the, the stuff, did you put up who's getting what spots? Or? Um, just. Okay. Can you guys see there. it? Yes, I see it from another view. Okay, wait, it's commercial. So you can stretch it. Like you add the second left here. Left hand there. No, it's not letting me. Stretch it on the X split screen. Uh, that's what I'm trying to do. I've got the window region random not a work sequence generator. The layout. Is that a little bit more viewable? Is that better, guys? Good. 
So you're going to put Donnie, Nolan, 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 Aaron, Chain. Let me see if we can print this out. But well, no, we did pick their leaves, but we should still test the random. We pick their divisions. So just to try it so you know how it works. Okay. So we did it. There you go. I'm taking a look to last. Okay, so we good with random that'll work then? Yeah. And Nationally central, nationally east, west gone. All the left ones. American move east is what Shane gets. Okay guys, so you can hear me. Donnie has the National League Central. Nolan has National League East. I do not like hearing myself on repeat. Nolan has National League West. Aaron has American League West, Shane has American League East, and Nolan has American League Central. Donnie and Nolan have traded the Padres and the Pirates, which I will personally be making sure is correct. Now ready to see some cards? At least in football, I know what the divisions are. So I'm going to be the slow card sorter because I know jack shit about baseball and divisions. Once we get into football and divisions, I'll be able to help fly through this. I'm going to be the sorter in the background. Shane is going to be the one opening cards. I know we'll get to know my bestest buddy Shane. So here we go. And thank you for being our test dummies and willing to try this with us and putting up with the hassles and the fuzz and whatever. So. Thanks, guys. I just put on here, no one is on a tree.
there. So to try to make this a little bit easier on Jess, I'm printing out uh, which division each of the teams are in, as well as which spot in the sorting tray they go. Uh, <laughs> just to show you the setup we've got for tonight. Um, I don't know if you guys have ever seen sorting trays like this before or not, but they're the no edged, no ding, uh, no corner ding trays where the corners are all recessed so that the card corners can't hit in the plastic. So. And that's my list. So that everybody knows I will not mess up the sorting. We got good guys at least. <laughs> Just so that everyone knows, I don't know what the standard is in the groups, but all bolt cards go in 10 count two piece plastic boxes to ensure that they don't get damaged in front and uh, shipping. Everything goes out in padded envelopes. Um, all inserts, penny sleeve, hard sleeve, team bag. So, here we go. If I'm not giving enough narrative, or the narrative's not schmaltzy enough, or too schmaltzy, just let me know. They like it when you announce the big hits. They like it when you breeze through quickly the base. Um, what am I missing here, guys? Say base out of base. Their biggest thing is they want to hear. There's all the base cards. And now in the first pack, we've got two chromes. One of Chris Bryant. Somebody's going to be happy with that. And Donnie. Taylor Williams. Chris Bryant goes to Donnie with the Cubs. Oh, they don't say teams on the front. Uh, same on the back. Oh, Yankees. Backwards. 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 And Taylor Williams. Backwards. There should be one in the box. All right, we've got base, base, base. Drew Ward, Chrome, Kobe Jones, Chrome, Buddy Borden, Purple Refractor, the Pirates, a base and a base. And the Purple Buddy Borden is numbered 142 of 250. That's right. People care about that level of detail. Especially when they're numbered, they like to at least have numbered of 250. You don't necessarily have to give them the rest. Keep in mind, guys, you're helping us decide how we're going to do these in the future, so feel free to give us any input that you want. Okay. Mm. Actually, it's uh, Jamie Moyer's son. That's fun. And we got Chrome, base, 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 Chrome, 
Now base. Uh, yes. Well, maybe a little bit. I see here what I can do. We got the external camera set up on a tripod, so give me one second, let me see what I can do to scrunch her down a bit. Oh, I'm looking at too much. Yeah, uh, just let me. How's that about right? See if I can get my hands in the right spot so you guys can see Nick Gordon Chrome, Patrol Chrome, number 32 on the top 100 prospects, Blake Swihart for Boston, and base. Is that numbered on the back of it, Jess? It is not. Okay. So Blake Swihart is not numbered. Like uh, this is the base. Marcus Molina Chrome. <clears throat> Smith. Oh, sorry. I'll get this figured out one of these years. <laughs> it's our first time. And a Romero Tampa Bay. Many unnumbered. And base cards. James, so I can actually get to where you guys can see what I'm doing here. Space, space. Aerosol Iglesias Chrome. Zach Wheeler. No serial number. Looks like they're Ice wave, whatever they're calling them this year. Cracked ice? Oh, refractors. And an AJ Cole. Chrome. It's kind of cool that they mix the chrome in with the regular Bowman for baseball. I like that. <laughs> what? Thanks, Casey. No, that's good advice. What did he say? Casey said, yeah, get it all set up where you're comfortable, because some breaks you will be there a while. Yeah, they're talking cases. Yeah. <laughs> now, this is this is mainly so I can have the funds to pick up two cases of uh, Allen and Gettner this summer. Uh, Alex Meyer Chrome. David Dahl Chrome. And a... Rusty Castillo, uh, the farm's finest mini insert. Now, watching this one thing's for sure, I never would have made it as a hand model. <laughs> I could. I could do it. Uh, got a Ryan Merritt Chrome. Ramon Quinn. You know, I'm not sure what kind of refractor that, that they're calling these this year, but it's kind of like the ice that they've had in previous years. Donnie will probably know. He does baseball a lot. And a Jack Rainheimer Chrome. 
Chrome Wizard is Casey. Casey says they are called Ice this year. Ice. Thank okay. you, Casey. Look on the back here. Yeah, base mm -hmm. silver one in 53, purple one in 105, blue one in 175. Uh, silver ice one in 24, so they can't be that. Those are, you're seeing these a lot more often than one in 24. Okay. Two good rookies. We got a chrome Kyle Zimmer. Chrome Chad Pender. I apologize both to the players and their families <laughs> I'm butchering any names. Gilbert with Laura Crone. And Lewis Radio. <laughs> Fortunately, my six month old is in bed. What did he say? Jason says that his six-month-old is watching. It seems very interesting. I, I, my three-year-old always asks every time I go to put an order out, do I get a card, Daddy? <laughs> it's like, well, let's go upstairs and see if we can find you one that's off-cut and not worth much more than packing material. And thank God she hasn't figured out how to get into the real stock downstairs yet. Raphael Deaver's Chrome. Matt Andres. Tampa Bay, Rob Kaminsky, the farm's finest. And hopefully this isn't so out of focus that it's making anyone seasick. If you can see it clearly on your screen, they can see it clearly. Yeah, we'll get, let's see if I turn off that light. Maybe not lose power. We're just starting to get a bit of a glare. Let's see if that's too dark or if it's better. And how long the computer will stay on since that was the light switch for the outlet that it's plugged into. That's a little bit better, not much. Josh Hamilton. Oh. Uh, base, base. Oh, Jose Abaroo. Somebody wanted one of those. So, part number 120 base, but still a nice card. Jose Peraza Chrome. Scott Shedler, perhaps. Chrome. Now, this is the first Bowman product of a year, so it's always interesting to see how many goodies they actually put in. It seems like there's a lot of inserts in Chrome, at least. There's a fair number of Chrome, but if the base parallel silvers are 1 in 53, you're not going to get one in every box. So there's an awful lot of stuff that's... Uh, yeah. Bowman Scout top 100 inserts are 1 in 8, die cut 1 in 398. Super Fractors 1 in 17,351. So, this could be a product that's a little bit hard to get big hits. We've got a Jimmy Reed Chrome. An Austin Hedges number 52 of the top 100. For San Diego, insert. And an Avery Romero. Right, 
after this, we've got about six packs left. So I'll be sitting, seeing the autograph soon. Yay! <laughs> yep, Nick. Reese McGuire, Chrome. Phillips Chrome. Uh, Tim Anderson, Farm's Finest. Hey, Donnie, you upset you gave up those pirates yet? We're cleaning house. Bowers Chrome. And a She Wei Hugh. <laughs> okay. Minnesota Twins. This is no hate the Pirates. Poverty's got a few too. They did. Just making sure. <laughs> right, good old R.A. Dickey, former Mariner. Yeah, half the Mariners they have listed, I've never even heard of. Tim Anderson, White Sox, Chrome. Oh, there you go. We got it. Who's got the twins? Um, oh, I gotta get up to the list. Pardon the reach in the shirt, but this one is not even going to make sure that Twins. it's touched by nothing but the edges and goes directly into the soft sleeve. Are the American sleeve. League Central, American League Central, National League Central, National League East, no one. No one got it. So nice. Let's see if that'll focus. Number seven to two fifty. Nick Gordon Purple Auto. Yeah, the rest of that pack also had a Eric Haas Chrome. Padre Rookie, or Liriano. The Earth Morgan Mariners Chrome. And there. Looks like it might be a Silver Ice. Or 44, 499, Francellus Montes. Or the White Sox. Pass me a soft sleeve. Pass me a soft sleeve. Yes. I gotta learn these divisions. <laughs> uh, AL Central. American League Central, which I believe is also Nolan. Come here, here, say hi to the guys. Go stand over by Shane and say hi. This is the only time you get to be on video. So y'all hear me talk about my kiddo. Can they yep. see you? Yep, right there. There you go. Say hi, guys. No, yeah, say hi. They can hear you. They can hi. hear us talk. <laughs> what do you need, honey? Um, I can show Doc because go um, get a piece of toilet paper and pick it up and throw it in this toilet. It's okay. The other guys have their babies screaming in the background. They're all used to it. <laughs> huh, Casey? Huh? I'm not sure who got the Angels, but Mike Trout. Uh, Angels. Amanda. American League West yep. went to Aaron. So Aaron got the Trout. Fernando Perez Chrome. 
They were number 45 on the top 100. Uh, Rusney Castillo from Boston. Nice long sleeve. Jose Valdez, Chrome. Cliff Lee, regular. They say hi to Deacon. <laughs> Uh, last I saw was Lone Star Breakers who said, oh, hell yeah. That's Corey. What's the oh, hell yeah for, Corey? We got a Chrome James Needy for the Don er, Padres. And a TJ Chisholm for the Mets. Looks like we're down to the last five packs here. <laughs> For the kids in the background. Yes. Mine's behaving at least. Mine's old enough to behave. <laughs> we got a forest wall, chrome, sus. I'm not even going to try that one. Stretch. Stretch. That would have been a brutal name to grow up with, making it sound like the Third Reich. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, what are they mimicking? Oh no, that's probably them trying to message me on Facebook because I'm the last one logged in. You Darvish base. Not that he's done anything to make me happy about his value on the rookie cards. We got a Richardo Sanchez Chrome. The base cards put together here. Alex Verdugo Chrome. And looks like a Frank Thomas Chrome Refractor. Does not appear to be numbered, but that's interesting. That's a, only one refractor out of the box. Maybe the card sleeve we go. Frank Thomas. That's not the same Frank Thomas that I'm thinking of. Uh, Danny says, we need the other one to fill. Have you shared it in any other rooms? Um, I shared it in Kick-Ass, the filler. Not a single comment last I checked. Ty Block Chrome and an Adrian Sampson Chrome. This picture of Matt Holiday there. Pack? No, second to the last. Okay. Uh, Jalen Garcia Chrome. A purple. Wes Parsons. Roman first card. Do you remember well, 198 or 250? Are you keeping all the, the high-end stuff slightly separate or? No, I probably should have. I just put it with the teams because there's... And John Gray Chrome. Well, we ought to be able to tell it from what's in the heart sleeves. Well, yes. The, so normally that. at the end they go over the hits. Okay. So like I set the hard sleeves aside, and normally they do go over the hits at the end. 
So, sorry guys, tonight we're not doing a review because... Well, we should be able to because there's not going to be that many cards. Uh, as long as they don't want to do a review of all the inserts. <laughs> Harold Ramirez. Well, they're just, I mean, it'd be nice to at least be able to do the numbered... Yeah, the numbers and the autos, sure. Yeah. But... Francellus Montes of the White Sox. Oh, sorry. Keep saying stuff and then looking up and realizing that all you see is my knuckles and not the card. And gentlemen, and lady present, <laughs> that was the end of the box. That's a numbered. So. So, question, guys, real quick. I'm going to flash this. Can we see this one? Is yes. this a card you would want to be displayed in the hits at the end? Non-numbered. Yeah. I would probably say yes, just from the fact that we only got one of them. I mean, even though it's not numbered, it's still just like that Frank Thomas refractor. If they're really one per box, even though they're not numbered, they can be fairly. They should buck halfway decent. Where's your card sleeves? I would assume this is, I don't know if it's out in the Beckett yet or not, but it should be on the Beckett. I think it's got to be, hopefully those don't shatter when you do that. No. You can actually hit them hard enough that they do. Oh, I've never had them. You just tap them a little bit and it's enough to pop them down without smashing them with your fingers. Yeah. Because I feel really good. So I believe, unless we want to pull the minis too, those are the hits from our box. I mean... Let me see what you're saying. Uh... Is this a hit to review or a simple insert to leave aside? Not in bigger breaks, but small chair. Okay. So any of y'all know if this is, has booked in the Beckett yet or not? Is it out in the magazine? Or? Donnie's probably the only one with a baseball Beckett. Well, one thing I can do since I do have a storefront on Beckett. Yeah, hit him up, and if you guys ever go shopping on his page, mention my name in an email prior to order, and you get a discount. Let me see if they've got it priced yet or not. Otherwise, I'm pretty sure that those are your hits from the boxes. The box. Okay, well, the big one I'm sure everybody wants to know about is that guy right there. So, one Chrome Prospect autograph, purple refractors. Now, is it considered kosher or not kosher to actually give back at prices, or is that viewed as a good thing or a bad thing? Or Never really in breaks unless somebody asks you to send them a private message. These guys, go ahead. They're all admins. They run groups. That's why I selected them to be our test dummies. But for the most part, no. Oh, yeah, and I wouldn't, wouldn't try this, especially on a big break. Uh... Not when you're doing six boxes. <laughs> it's a shame the camera's not focusing any better. Hmm. Now let's let, let's see what the guys have to say. Hmm. Do 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 you want to know what the Beckett value is on that card or not? Yeah, go ahead, buddy. Oh, I was, I was waiting to see if they had any. And put one way or the other. Then he says no. There 
All right, so you have that. You have the purple Buddy Borden chrome refractor numbered to 250. And I apologize, I'm going to play with the camera a little bit more to figure out how to get them to focus more often. For the Pirates. The Braves. Wes Parsons. Number to 250. Just went over the big items. The silver. Frangelis Mont Montes. Serial number to 499. And the non numbered Frank Thomas Chrome Refractor. Well, it's hard with the rookies. I, I, I you know. For somebody that's actually played for a couple of years, I I, I, know, I know certainly know who Frank Thomas is. I know the Abaroos and the, the uh, Bryants and stuff like that. Some of these kids that are either rookies or NL teams, I'm I'm not. A, I usually follow the AL, not the NL. So any other suggestions, criticisms? Now, either everyone thinks it went great or is falling asleep, Jess. No, there's no way. <laughs> there's about 15 seconds away, not all of them are changing the game session. <laughs> I know because I have them on my messenger. But you can choose to cut feed for the video. Okay. And still chat will stay open. And then that's when you would upload the video to YouTube. Okay.